Hello, my beautiful collective. This is Renee, and welcome. Today I have a channeled message from the Divine Masculine. Let's deep dive into his thoughts and feelings and navigate our own thoughts and feelings. Hello. I was just thinking about you. And I was wondering if you still think about me too. Things aren't exactly going the way I planned. I planned on doing so many things. But it feels like I just can't get them right. Like all my plans just fall through. They fall through the cracks. <laughs> I've been wanting so much to talk to you. I pick up the phone and look at your number even attempt to push the button and then it just fails I can't do it I've done so many things wrong I've taken so many bad choices and <laughs> to tell the truth this last one was a real doozy I'm not sure we can come back from this last one. But I'm hoping. I'm hoping that you understand. I'm hoping that you kind of see things from my point of view. How hard it is. Feeling a love like yours and being so overwhelmed by my own feelings. I just, I needed a break from the intensity, you know? I needed a break from feeling so much. And so strong. Mm. You would send me a text and I could almost feel the vibes through your words. I've never felt like that. I've never felt like this. And even though I've tried, I've tried so hard to move past this, to kind of bury you deep inside, telling myself that it would never work, that I would just ruin it, that I would just hurt you and break your heart. I wanted so much to save you from that. I wanted you, I wanted to save you from me. So, I chose her instead. Something I felt would be easier. someone I didn't have so many feelings for someone who doesn't inspire me the way that you do but it is easier 
and she gives me what I need. At least I feel like that. At least I keep telling myself that. Because what you gave me was so much more. And I'm finding out that what you gave me can never be replaced. Nothing compares. Nothing compares to what it is we shared. And I miss that so much. I know you feel like I was one foot in and one foot out or that I ignored you or ghosted you but the simple fact is I just didn't know what to say my feelings run so deeply And they, frankly, they scare the complete hell out of me. It overwhelms me so much. I've never felt like this. No one has ever loved me. I mean truly loved me the way that you do and that scares the hell out of me because I don't want to mess it up so when you call or when you text when you send me these sweet little messages I kind of freeze. I'm a deer in the headlights. I don't know what to do next. And I know I've completely messed up everything. I really fouled things up this time. And... I'm not quite sure how to get out of it. And the plans that we made together, I find myself completing those plans with someone else. And I know it hurts you. And I'm so very sorry. I never meant to hurt you. That's the least thing I ever want to do. You mean more to me than words could ever say. And I think about you every single day even in the moments I really don't want to some days I just want to be free from thinking about you I want to be free from this heartache of not having you near because it hurts Now, I truly know how you feel. And now I'm wondering if you're thinking about me still. I'm hearing things from people 
gossip, of course. <laughs> Who was new, right? That you're seeing someone else. Which really is only fair. I've put you through so many tests. I've put you through so many things. And still, you inspire me. Because you're so strong. So beautiful. And even when you slip up, babe, you do it with class, right? And I know it's hard. But I know you're strong. And while I'm dealing with the things that I need to deal with, I'm not asking you to wait for me. But I'm asking you to be open. Be open to me, please. And when it's time, please forgive me for everything I did, everything I put you through, every time I didn't text you back. Every time I changed our plans, every time I disappointed you, know that I'm so sorry and that you are embedded in my mind. I don't see you going anywhere anytime soon. And I just hope that you're open to me. You're open to forgiving me and hearing me out. Because when it's time, when I get up enough nerve and fix these things within me, let go of all my burdens, I will have so much to tell you. I'll have so much to say. Please be open to me. I love you.